Not being a cranking it up to 11 in Faulkner County soon if a proposed noise ordinance is passed. Mowing your lawn or using a leaf blower or shredding your base could be hit with a fine. Well, tomorrow night, the Courts and Public Safety Commission for the county are meeting to discuss it. Haley Brooks has more on how this ordinance will work. Tuesday night, the Faulkner County Courts and Public Safety Committee will be meeting in this room, and members expect a full turnout after receiving a lot of feedback for a potential noise ordinance. I think people want to enjoy their freedoms. I don't think they want more restrictions on them. The Faulkner County Courts and Public Safety Committee will be discussing a proposed noise ordinance in their Tuesday night meeting. We spoke with Chris Kendrick, who's on that committee. They implement a noise level for the daytime and the nighttime, and they're different. Uh, and from that, if people exceed those those levels, then they could be fined by the county. Here's a look at the proposed ordinance. It says between the times of 10 p.m. to 6 a.m., the noise level should not exceed 65 decibels. And from 6 a.m. to 10 p.m., no more than 75 decibels. For comparison, the CDC released an article showing how loud everyday sounds are. For example, a washing machine is 70 decibels. Gas-powered lawnmowers and leaf blowers are 85 both of those higher than the daytime limit. Uh, the way it's currently written, I couldn't support this bill. I don't like it. I do think it infringes on people's rights on how they use their property. Kendrick says hundreds of people have spoken up against this ordinance. And Tyler Lahosky, another justice of the peace, says his phone has been ringing off the hook too. At least one call, Facebook message, text message, uh, at, at least every 15 minutes today about it. Um, it's, just, it's been pretty constant today. Um, please vote no, please vote no, please vote no, please vote no. To enforce it, the Faulkner County Sheriff's Office would be equipped with a decibel meter. Kendrick says he believes this would have to be purchased. How much it would cost is undetermined. It would also be up to the County Sheriff's Office to conduct on-site investigations and take sound measurements. You know, for me, it's a, it's a no vote right now. Kendrick says if there was changes made to the ordinance that made it less restrictive on people's daily lives, he might consider it. Reporting in Faulkner County, I'm Haley Brooks. Back to you. According to the proposed ordinance, if violated, you'll be fined between $100 to $250 for the first offense and $250 to $500 for the second offense. The Courts and Public Safety Committee will meet tomorrow night at 6 o'clock. Whether it's passed or not, the discussion could go to the Faulkner County Quorum Court next week. Today, 300.